I'm joined today by amazing producer and DJ John Dolbach. Hey John, how are you doing tonight? Very good, thank you. Good. So you have your own record label, Mutants Records. How is that different from Picadol Records, the other record label that you were involved with? It's no different at all. We just changed the name, basically. Okay. It's a, f a fresh start. Nice. And what do you look for in artists that you're bringing onto the record label? Uh, someone who's original and, and you stick into their ideas and not really listening too much of what's going on otherwise and just, you know, doing their own thing. And what's going through your head when you're performing on stage and you're doing your DJ sets? Nothing. It's blank. It's completely blank. You were, you were younger. I heard that you came from a very musical family. So how did you get into DJing and producing? Um, I got into it by my cousin Jesper, who's like a techno legend from Sweden. And I was producing, or not producing, I was playing around with the computer when I was 13 and 12 or something. And then I got into house music and I started doing that. And then I sent out a bunch of demos when I was 14 and got a release when I was 15. Um, yeah, and that's... Um, and in the background, I, my dad is a drummer and my mom is a singer, and then I have played the drums, piano, and guitar. Okay, and um, what do you look for in tracks? You said that you know within a couple seconds whether a track fits or not in the work that you're doing, so what is it that you're looking for in particular? Yes, if a track is, is um, having something that stands out, and if it doesn't, it, it, I just throw it away. It's no, I don't like working on things that I know from the beginning is not going to be good enough. And I just want to make music that's um, somehow different than the rest. Okay. And um, another fun little question, if you were a superhero, what powers would you want to have? To fly. To fly. <laughs> All right, I think that about wraps it up. So thank you so much for being with us, John, and we can't wait to hear your set.